Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great. If you're new, hi, my name is Himadri and I do post fashion and makeup related content on my channel. In today's video, I'm going to teach you guys how to get this look. This is my no foundation makeup look. So it's totally wearable during the day. You can totally wear this look to an office party, a get together, Diwali parties, what not. There are going to be a lot of events that you might have to attend and don't want to do a lot of makeup and you want to look very subtle, natural yet very presentable. This look is for you. So if you guys want to know more then you should definitely keep on watching. Okay you guys, so I'm just going to pull my hair back because you don't want any makeup on your hair. I have already applied some moisturizer and today I also went ahead and applied some under eye cream because I don't know why but my under eye area felt very very dry and it needed it so I went ahead and applied some under eye cream. As this is going to be a daytime look, it's very 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 important to apply a sunscreen. I have talked about this on my channel before, it's very important to use a sunscreen no matter how the weather it is outside. Even if it's rainy, cloudy, sunny, humid, whatever, you need to protect yourself honey from the harmful UV rays, the heat, the pollution. If you are using a sunscreen already, you need to start using it right away. So today I'll be using the Wow Skin Science Sunscreen. This has a face serum infused in it which is a great thing. Also, this is SPF 35. It has some really good ingredients. It has raspberry extract, carrot seed extract, avocado oil. Uh, also, this is paraben free, uh, silicon free, mineral oil free and cruelty free, which is amazing. And the price point is very reasonable as well. This retails for 400 rupees only and you get 50 ml of product. So I'm just going to squeeze a little bit of product on my hand. I'm going to apply this on my face, neck and wherever my skin is showing. absorbed into the skin also this does not leave a white cast if you're a brown skin girl you can relate to this that whenever we apply a sunscreen it leaves a white cast on the skin which is not cute a thumbs up for this that it does not leave a white cast on the skin i'm going to let this sunscreen sit on my face for about five minutes and then i'm going to start off with the makeup for the base today, I'll go very simple and natural. I won't be using any foundation, just concealer and I'll do some spot concealing where I need coverage. As I said before, my under eye area is feeling a little dry lately, so I'm going to use a hydrating concealer. If you're normal to oily skin, you can definitely go ahead and use a mattifying concealer. Try the LA Girl concealer or the Maybelline Fit Me, it works really well. I have two options today. This one is the Wet n Wild uh, Photo Focus Concealer and this is in the shade Medium Deep Tan and this one right here is from Colourpop, this is their No Filter Concealer and this is in the shade Medium Dark. If Colourpop would have been available in India, I would have used this one today for sure but unfortunately it's not so I'm going to use the Wet n Wild instead. I'm going to use this under my eyes of course because I look like a panda. Also where I have blemishes. I'm going to use a damp sponge to blend this out because if I use a brush it might dry out my under eye. As this sponge is damp it's going to add some moisture to my skin. I'm going to add a little more concealer where I need more coverage. Before my concealer starts freezing, I'm going to set that in place using the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. This is in the shade 25 medium.